Remember WWE 2K14? Ah, the good old days. Where you could just slap any song you want, put it as your entrance music, and just enjoy the game? Well, since 2K pissed on 2K14, the custom music features has not made a return even in 2K23. I mean seriously, why would they kill such a fan beloved feature? It just makes no sense. I paid for this crap and I can't even get custom music entrances? Come on. Anyhow, thanks to the modding community, shout out to Gwicks and Rips and to all the modders out there. You can achieve this custom music feature with a few simple steps. Disclaimer, this will only work on PC. If you have a PlayStation or Xbox, then you're out of luck, man, since modding is not yet supported in consoles. So, um, uh, yeah, I'm, so, I'm sorry. Anyways, if you're on PC, congratulations. You can now have custom music entrances like this one. For the sake of our sanity, let's just not do that and instead change Kane's current boring theme Kane! to his legendary slow chemical theme. First of all, you're gonna need three things. The 2022 sound editor, the updated XML files for 2K23, and the WEM file for your music. And as always, I'll leave the links in the description. Before we proceed, if you like this kind of content, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more WWE 2K stuffs. Thanks! Okay, first off, we need to get Sound Editor 2022. Now I know this software is for WWE 2K22, not 23, but yeah, it will still work on 2K23. 2K23's Sound Editor is still being worked on as of today. When it will be released, yeah, I'll probably make a video for that one as well. But for now, let's just use Sound Editor 2022. Check the link on the description box of this video since I know you're too lazy to Google Sound Editor yourself. This will lead you to a Smack Talks page. I think you need to create an account first before you can download stuff. So yeah, go ahead and do that. So browsing this page, there's a section where it says Download Installer. Click that one and it will lead you to a Google Drive link. Go ahead and download the installer. Now, if there's no Google Drive link and it will just download instantly, then uh, good for you. Next, we're gonna need the updated XML files for our Sound Editor so that it will work for our 2K23 game. Go to the second link in the description and it will lead you to pro wrestling mods. Go ahead and create an account here as well so you can download their stuffs. By the way, this website is full of great mods. You should check them out. Another disclaimer, some files in pro wrestling mods can only be downloadable if you have the game on your Steam account, which means if you have a crack or a pirated copy of 2K23 or 2K22, then go ahead and download the XML files. The last step is to get a WIM file for the music that you want to add in your game. Now this can be done in two different ways. First one is to look for WIM files on the sound section in the PWM site. The second one, however, which I'm about to show you, is to make your own WIM file for your music. We're gonna need the music for Kane's slow chemical theme, so let's just hop into YouTube and whoops. I found this one and it's kind of nice. So now we have all the files that we need to have our custom entrance music. First things first, go ahead and install Sound Editor 2022 alongside the WYS launcher. Now in the WYS launcher, you need to open it up and you need to install the WYS app or software. I don't know what it's called. You need to install this as well. Next, extract and copy the XML files that we downloaded earlier to the main directory of your Sound Editor 2022 that you have just installed. If a dialog box appears like this, just click replace. Open Sound Editor and if it says XML file loaded, then you're good to go. Now we need to tell Sound Editor where is our WYS directory is and also to what location our created WEM files will go. To do this, go to Sound Editor and click Settings. Here, set the directories to their proper locations. The first one is where our WEM files will go after we created them and the second one is where your WYS directory was installed. We're almost there. We need to create the WEM file for our custom music. If you already have a WEM file, then you can go ahead and skip this step. Go to Sound Editor, Tools, and click on Converter. Browse the MP3 file that you want. Leave the settings here as is, or you can just experiment, I don't know, but just leave this like this because it will work. And just click Convert. Wait for the confirmation message to appear, and then close the converter. For the last step, we need to import our WEM file to our 2K23. To do this, on your Sound Editor, click File, then Open, browse your 2K23 directory, and go to the Music folder. 
here you can find all the entrance music for all the wrestlers in the game, divided into these files. Each file has a group of wrestlers on them, so if you want to replace the actual music, for example, Kane's, you need to browse each of those files and look for the one that says Kane or something. I'm not gonna do that however, instead I will just replace those unused generic music that they added. Most of those generic music are in Music 8, go ahead and open that, and it will now show you a list of all the entrance music that is in this specific file. If yours doesn't show the names or probably some weird bug or glitch is there on the names, then you probably messed up and didn't copy the XML files correctly. Go ahead and rewind this video and copy those files correctly for goodness sake man, come on. For this, I will replace Spark 1. Right click that music that you want to replace, select import, browse the WIMP file that we have created earlier or the one that you downloaded and click open. It will say backing up or something, you know, blah blah blah. Just wait for it to say file data injected and then you're done. You can also double check if it got imported correctly by right clicking the name and click play. Now the only thing that's left to do is to go to your game, pick the wrestler that you want, mine here's Kane, and choose the entrance music that you replaced on your sound editor, and voila! From the ashes, Kane continues to live a tortured existence and is hungry for revenge. Pure demonic rage in his eyes. Feeding off the infernal flames of hell. So thank you guys for watching. If you like this one, please don't forget to like the video and subscribe to this channel if you're into WWE games, especially moddings and stuffs. See you in the next tutorial or the next gameplay. Thank you for watching. Peace out.